guys this is Mast and welcome back to some more predecessor today we're playing a little crunch in the offlane now fair warning this video might be a little off a little funky i have had a doozy of a weekend not really gonna dive into it a uh, little little mentally off right now i don't think i'm gonna flame or anything just like i don't know it might it might be a little bit weird i thought i'd throw it out there there's reasons that we're uh that we're not gonna get into at all um we're against richter in the offlane i don't know if i've ever actually played against this guy um I did actually just play with the actual person. I actually just played with this guy. He was my support last game, popping off, playing a little Kira EDC. Which, by the way, I'm curious. Um, now, maybe I shouldn't even ask because it kind of doesn't matter. I was going to see if anybody like wanted to chime in with whether you guys care or not if I duplicate characters that much. Because I want to do another Kira video soon since that video was a little bit scuffed. And no, I still don't want to upload the video. I really, there was a genuine reason I didn't want to upload that one. Like... Like, there's been some masked pickiness to deny videos before. This was not it. This was just, like, normally I kind of judge videos by, like, would I want to watch it? And, uh, I didn't think the answer was going to be no going in. Normally I can remember most of what happens pretty well. But that time it was a no. That time it was an absolute no. I'm assuming jungle is probably... Uh, they actually might have a blue buff jungler this time around. They got... Wait, Countess... Who the hell's jungle? Wait. Steel? Their team is weird. I just processed how weird their team is. I feel like their team's capable of not being that weird, depending on where they put the people. Do a little bopping. We do a little bopping. Oh my god, we do a lot of bopping. I kind of want to uh, to flash on him. I think I might get a little greedy. I don't know if this is going to be upgraded or not. It was not. I think that's still worth, because... Oh, I got cooked! Did I get cooked? I don't even know if that actually cooked me or not. Oh, I got cooked. We're dead. Man missed. Okay, it doesn't matter. <laughs> it almost mattered. I actually don't think that's even bad. Uh, because I'm still getting used to win. If it worked the way I wanted it to, it's a kill. And then honestly, like, I just kind of didn't think he would even have chain. Because I feel like normally it's probably not worth. But I haven't really played against uh, Richter solo. Richter offlane, maybe I should say. We lose a stupid amount of farm off that, by the way. That is tragic. I assumed, um... In my head, it was very weird timing at that point to still be lurking as jungle. So I don't know if my timers are just completely off or what, because I feel like our jungler is like on the other side of the map at this point. <laughs> and their jungler was just still doing offlane buffs or coming back to them or whatever. So we'll see if we get level three off this. I kind of doubt we do. But, but either way, I don't think that's too bad because we got to learn a little something. And I basically have confirmed that I am smacking this man up early. Oh, I thought that would be a last hit there. Nice, we actually do get level 3. That I'm smacking him up early as long as we don't get yoinked into tower for I don't even know how much damage. So, um, Crunch is... Is he actually pulling this? He is actually pulling this. Don't think he gets to pull this. Like, he can maybe deny me a little farm. I'm assuming, surely if I go on him here, that's mine. Like, he's just losing this. Yeah, like, he's just actually dead? He's just actually dead. That was such a... <laughs> that was such an hit, man. <laughs> yeah, I'm thinking, like, Richter early game can't be that good other than just yoink into tower with pull. And then he really did just try in 1v1. The auto-cancel god! auto can I gotta get used to not saying god. Auto-cancel hero. Crunch is, um, I brought up in a different video, Crunch seemed a lot like Rob, and if he was remotely interesting, after having played him a little more, I think he might be about the same, le the same level of interesting. I don't find Robin very interesting. I think Crunch realistically probably is more so, because Robin's such a simple character in Smite. And I still, I don't know how many people have purely been watching these, because they've found me through a predecessor. I'm going to make a lot of Smite references, because that's definitely most of what the channel has been. Which might bug people sometimes. What are we doing, man? I'm going to trust that we're not getting ganked. God, this guy is such a bully. It's ridiculous. Can I get the E on him? I probably shouldn't have autoed that last time. Oh, he was feeling that one. Okay, so flashes are down for both. If he goofs, we can kill. Oh, he got his passive back, though. Uh, sir? Yeah, I don't know if you want that. Okay, I heard a little something, and I don't know what the something means. We place a ward. Boom. I don't know what I heard there. I really want to dive. If I get pulled into tower, there's no reason I should tank it. So I can kind of linger up here. That's fine. Man gets wave. 
See what we're looking at CS-wise. A little bit ahead. Not a big surprise. I mean, he's just like a straight-up tank. I do want to actually play some um, some tank offlaners slash maybe junglers soon. Finally start getting into that. I'm actually running into an issue where um, I'm not able to unlock that many people for a while unless I dip some real money in, which I might just do that. But I really want to unlock like Severog and Quang right now, who are both a little too expensive to afford quite yet. Trying to zone this guy a little bit if I can. Try and, try and keep him back there. Very tempted to get crazy in a sec. Oh, that doesn't reach as far as I thought it would. Oh, and I knew he was going to go for it. We got a little wiggly on him. Yeah, definitely could have been punished there. Jungle is here, but I do not care. Okay, this should just be a kill, surely, right? Surely? Yeah. Then we do a little smack on this guy. Oh! Uh Bonk? Oh, too bad. Yeah, I wanted to get my R off. I was thinking it'd be up sooner. And then we just straight up don't reach the Q. I don't know if at some point I goof that. I feel like he probably just doesn't die there. Very tempted to greed this. I don't know if I can. 10 seconds. Oh, it's so gr it's so greedy. It's so, so greedy. I don't think he has vision of me, so I'm feeling like I can get away with it. Yeah, I don't think we're going to see it all that much yet. We really need to get Ability Haste online. I've only played Crunch one game. Or, well, I've played him technically a game forever ago. Let's see, it looks like he's not going to bother with me. Um, Like, my first game ever. But he's got a pretty intuitive kit. But he is also a weirdo. So, there's going to be some learning for me to do. Where I feel like I basically know what the things do. We've got a dash. We've got a slow slash and knockup. We've just kind of got a big bonk. The Q and the E is we get them leveled up, get really low cooldowns. And then we're just auto-canceling for cooldown slash damage. But as we get the haste online in this build from going... We're gonna go augmentation. We'll go some other haste item as well. I don't know what we'll go next. Um, and as we get all that online, we're gonna start getting super low cooldowns and basically do the smite equivalent of Bumpus Hammer things. So a little bit like what we were doing in the, uh, the recent Fang Mao video. But the Fang Mao is more burst and this is more sustained trading. Oh, we are getting some farm right now. I think I gotta go bully mode really hard. Steel's over in the middle lane, too. I think I gotta do some things to this man. Try and get him to push up a little bit. Thank you. Appreciate it. Wanna be ulting this so we get knock up. Actually, probably should be ulting my Q, huh? Just because it's so much higher level. Okay, that's his flash. I think we just take that. Not sure if I'm getting a kill there or not. And if we are, we probably just get to kill him soon off it anyways. So, why waste it? Oh, there's up. <laughs> Whoops. There's a thing down there. Yeah, this poor guy, I feel like he doesn't get to do much right now. I don't know if this is just a really bad matchup. It probably is a pretty bad matchup, to be honest. Yeah, right now, I do think he's playing with the distance enough that I'm not going to get a really go on him and have it pay off. One thing, I don't remember if I actually brought it up. We upgrade our abilities, I think, every three abilities. We get, like, enhanced effects. I am not going to do a good job at keeping track of that. That is, it's like, that's kind of the thing where this guy gets a little weird, where in a way he's a very simple character, and in a way he is not at all a simple character. He's got some weird stuff that you're supposed to get used to with him. Oh, and he was feeling that one, huh? Give him a bonk. That bonk did not do much. This guy should absolutely be building defense on Richter, so I think as we get a little deeper in the lane, he'll get a uh, fire blossom going, so they actually get some damage, and then also it'll just be harder to kill. What's he got right now? Wait, he's building a we Is he going damage? You weirdo? I think he is. We might just get to farm him then. I just didn't assume that would even be happening because I feel like it's going to be terrible. Uh, we can maybe do a little bit here. I think I goofed by not ulting that, but it looks like he's dead anyways. Yeah. I think realistically I should have ulted that. Our ult's not that important. It's something we're tend going to tend to get spammy with and brawly with. Yeah, the way the ult works, like, the, the core ability is pretty simple. The way the ult works is really interesting. You get some passive effects, and then you also just straight up make it so you recast your most recently cast ability. Oh, I wanted to see if I could get in there and mess up his, um, his little plant right there. See if we could knock him up so he didn't get bounced over. Which we probably didn't have, but I figured I'd hope. But yeah, sometimes we're going to upgrade the Q so that it does... I'm trying to think, does it actually do more damage if you're not cleaving? 
No, I think it does same damage, but it just cleaves consistently. And I think maybe gets a bigger hitbox. I'm not sure. The E goes from a slow to a knockup. And then our dash gets like longer and stronger or something. I don't remember exactly. Knocks people away. Something like that. So yeah, we'll go augmentation. We'll get those auto cancels going. Um, yes. Yeah, maybe we just go mutilator next. Mutilator is the recommended item. Um, but I went it the one little game I just played earlier today. I rushed mutilator and given it was into another crunch, so I didn't get a tell. But it kind of seemed like a weird item for him, where the ability haste is nice, but we're really not autoing that much. So it seemed like it made more sense to just build um, augmentation, because it's like perfect for this guy. We actually get tank here. I feel like we don't need the lifesteal that much. Should get a bunch of bonus damage, I think, compared to mutilator. But I could be wrong. I'm hoping we can actually make this guy fight a little bit. Right now it's kind of seeming like if we're not getting ganked, he's just going to tower sit so hard. And I don't really want to be that cringe in zone. Maybe we'll rotate mid. Oh, by the way, I fixed my VGS. Oh, it's so nice. I fixed my VGS. I really don't want to talk about what it was to fix it. I will, in case anybody has a similar issue. But oh my god, does it trigger me, man. Okay, we're kind of cooking here. <laughs> we kind of just crunched on him. This is what I'm talking about with this guy, where I do a little bit feel like, okay, he's kind of more fun than Robin. He's kind of not. Because I have some moments like this where I just feel like, okay, I played this character and I feel bad for having played the character, you know? It's like, wow, I really did auto cancel and press buttons. Now, in all fairness, I would assume as I get into higher level games, people are going to know the characters better and I'm going to get a crunch less easily and I'll have to cook a little bit more. But yeah, given that I didn't know really what crunch actually did up until like a couple days ago. I'm assuming a decent amount of the people I play against don't either. Yeah, does some menacing things that you might not see coming. The cooldown is ridiculous. The cooldown and the damage. Well, we're off to a good start over here. ADC's popping off. Jungle's doing all right. Seems like every lane's going pretty well. Let's see, if we get ganked, we're fine. We can do a little interesting something here. We can dash in, pop our ice, and then I don't think... Oh, we did just instantly get ganked. Okay, we have been very CC'd. We're going to flash for now, and then eventually we get dash. Actually, we turn right here. We got our jungle. Oh, and we got knock up right there. I think I knocked them up over my own Q, and that might have trolled me. Uh oh. Okay, well, <laughs> mid is here. That's okay. Grux might even be able to clap her. I'm not sure. That's fine. We got a little two for one. Maybe three for one in a sec. Yeah, I was close. I don't mind that one bit. See, all right, I guess we'll get this. Get a little more cooldown going for ourselves. Yeah, so right now we already have four second cooldown on the Q, six second cooldown on the E. And I think the E is going to get down to like five or four seconds once we actually finish leveling it. So what's ridiculous is we're also resetting cooldowns by one second when we're weaving in auto cancels, when we're landing an ability and then auto attacking in between. So normally we're trying to like E, auto, Q, auto, and then at that point, like, we're getting these cooldowns down to, like, two to three seconds already. Not even two items in. Which is kind of insane. So, we get a lot of aggressive high damage brawling. But we definitely can still get punished by ganks. Although, I do think we still probably live there. If I didn't... <laughs> I didn't know that my that I could knock them up over my Q. I thought it would just hit them. I also maybe could have, like, I don't know, maybe if I flick upwards it hits. I think if we get out of that fight a little earlier, I actually may be able to live against the Countess, I'm not sure. Alright, let's try and keep the minion wave here. Try and not get too punished. I feel like the vid's not really off, that's good. I have been through some shit, man. I have been through some shit. I feel like recording feels normal. Wasn't sure that it would. Was a little worried I'd have to do something weird for today's video. I still wanted to make sure I got a video up. Bonk. One thing I'll probably goof sometimes is I feel like his autos are really slow. And I gotta get used to that. What's it say our attack speed is? It says it's like decent. We're gonna back here just cause... I, I maybe actually could have pushed. I wanted to go rotate over to this. Uh, So nice that I can cancel out of that now, man. By the way, I got absolutely distracted. Um, see if the boys will do this with me. If they're down to rotate over, I should have leveled ult there, by the way. The way that I fixed my stupid VGS, I had, like, 
something something emotes unbound like toggle emotes unbound rebinding it fixed it so the the key went to v i don't know what the hell was going on for that i don't get it one bit but it's fixed so nice <laughs> okay, this does look like it's gonna end up being a 4v4 but i think we still get a bully Let's see okay we need we need boys man are we really just gonna leave ourselves to this i guess we are I'm trusting my jungle. Nice. Let's see if we can get in here. Oh, don't tether me. Don't be that guy. Grux? Find ya? Grux? Hmm. I think we're still... Like, he just kills him, yeah? He just kills him. Knock up there would have been so nice. That's okay. Flash is good. Also, he ented. I think. Hang on. I get dash soon. Yeah, he ended. Don't know what he's doing. Give him a smack. Okay, I might. I don't know what I'm doing. Tower's bonking my face. All right, I think we did. I don't know if they're gonna have that many people to defend this, but let's not greet it. Let's just go on back. So damage-wise, this game we got magic, magic, decent amount of magical. I don't remember how much steel does. So I think we're just going to go this legacy. Ooh, salvation could just HP might be nice. Hmm. Now we'll go legacy just because I want to keep messing with this. This is kind of a cool item. Um, You get a cleanse and a stupid amount of CC immunity when you get low. Doesn't actually make you all that tanky. Like we're getting 30 magic armor, but we actually get a lot of damage back. And I think the passive is pretty insane. By the way, yes, the dash is ridiculous. Got some absolutely insane range on it. I kind of don't even want to be here. I just want to go murder people in mid. Who cares about farm, man? Let me get to punching. Come on. I know you're there. You going to take the long way around? Yeah, you took the long way. Oh, messed that up. The hell? I don't even know what happened to that one. Forgot to level ult again. That's okay. Yeah, if we level ult, we get... I think the only thing we're getting right now is lower cooldown, but then we also get a way bigger heal. And the heal's pretty nice. The heal we're getting very often. It's like basically just as we do the crunch thing, <laughs> we heal. Which is kind of my issue so far. Like, it's early, don't get me wrong, but, but playing him a little bit, I do feel like he really does insanely well it a very specific thing over and over and over again and it seems kind of uh like it'd just be really frustrating to deal with super frustrating character see if we can rotate her someday not sure if it'll actually be worth it it might be they're still up there can probably kill quang at the very least try and get our boys in here you know what i'm a are you kidding me I was about to flash that if we didn't get trapped. Hang on, we get all the way in here. What's good? Okay, well, I didn't get to do what I wanted there. Should get a push tower here, though. We got so many people. Right, boys? Okay, I guess we have minions never, so maybe we don't. I kind of, you know what, he's got a thing. If he'll let me have this, that's too bad. He already had blue buff there. It would have been really good to let me last at that. I'm not going to blame him, though, because I would have <laughs> done the same thing. I definitely would not have thought about it. Oh. Get a punch. All right, don't do the thing. I feel he was about to do the thing, wasn't he? He had that look in his eyes. If he doesn't get Argus stunned, I think he goes for me there. So rude. Oh, that's got to be nice. No way he pushes up, right? Yeah, he's not greedy. That's fine. Come here. Yeah, so bad at keeping track of um, what's what. Like when we're getting our actual upgraded ability. I don't know if there's a way to tell. I haven't spotted it if there is. Obviously, you can just, like, count, but <laughs> that's annoying as hell. Especially if I'm talking, man. If I'm actively recording, I can't just be one, two, threeing in my head. That's too many things. 
All right, we get over here. I don't know what the hell is happening. Grux is trying to 1v5. Man's getting wild. Kind of did get wild. This should be really good right here. We ice on in there. Big punch. Bigger punch. Get some bonk on ya. Get some bonk. Okay, no, come here. Oops. I'm gonna try and greed my flash. That's why. Because we just simply stick. Alright, well, we're doing a little demolishing. I don't know if we go mid or if we go for a camp here. Because, like, Orb Prime is spawned. Fangtooth is spawned. I kind of want to do this. Oh, Andy's getting greedy on me. Andy's getting so greedy on me. What is this, man? Oops, I goofed it. Oh, I also thought he went up that. <laughs> we don't need to talk about that. We can forget. <laughs> I bet I saw him, too. I bet I actually, like... I really thought he got up there. I don't know why. I bet it didn't even look like that. I'm just dumb. Okay, we probably should have gone to do... Maybe we just go do it anyways. Go do Fangtooth. It's been weird, man. I feel like I'm running into so many of the same people over and over and over again in these games. Like this Kira, this Grux. Um, like at least three people on their team. Like half the people in this game, I'm pretty sure I've played with before. Okay, we need a little more money. Don't know if it'll be that easy to get. What are we doing, man? No, we're not. Come here. Come here. No, we're not doing that either. Get some punch. Okay, I maybe should have turned on her sooner. Didn't think the man would be dying. Oh, I don't even know. Where the hell do you go? She do her little TP thing on me? All right, let's hope we're not getting murdered by Murdockle. I don't even know if it hits hard enough. It probably does. We're super squishy. Finally get this done. And then we probably go Draconum as well, because I don't really see a reason not to. They don't have that much physical damage, but we're definitely going to be able to... Um, definitely going to want to tank the ADC. And this does just give me, like, stupid damage. We do just get 60 power, I feel like, super often. Maybe maybe I'm tripping on that. We're, we're so brawly on this guy. I feel like it'll be pretty easy to stack it up. We actually did that. So rude. Be dead. All right, do we do a little orb prime here? Huh? Oh, Grex is backing. Hang on. I'm assuming he wants to do it after the back, though. Hang on, I'll be taking this. No, I'll be taking this. Don't think Argus needs attack speed. Oh, we get in here, though. Hold up! Ma'am? Stop, that's a punch. I'm just gonna greed, because I like I don't think she's ever living here. Okay, well... I thought she'd just be dead to the R. I'm kind of mind blown that she's not, but she does have a lot of life seal. So I probably could have scuffed it. I mean, I basically dumped, like, absolutely nothing other than core kit there, thinking that was so free. Uh Okay, there is three, so... <laughs> Maybe we don't get to do it. As tempting as it may be. I'm just trying to get over to left lane here. And it looks like he banked. We'll go peak camp. Oh, is he on this? No, what did I hear? Probably literally nothing. I don't know. It's fine. Yeah, it's so weird for me. I feel like most of the abilities basically feel the same charged up or not. The E gets a crazy difference to me when it's charged. That's what I gotta get used to is getting the um the uppercut instead of just the little jab on that. Okay, can we do this? You down? You down? Like it's gotta be Surely it's free, right? Because I can tank it a decent amount. And then Grux is going to Grux all over it. Alright, we are Oom though. So, I don't know how much more I got to tank it. Alright, I think I'm going to reset here. 
Do a little dipping. Ooh, or do we go Infernum? Does it actually do that much on me? I feel like probably not. Yeah, I think we'll just get this. The farm's been really solid this game, given I'm off lane, so I'm probably just... <laughs> I haven't really been off laning that much, I'm probably just not that used to it. And we are super fed as a team. But almost level 16 at 25 minutes is, is really good. I feel like typically being on pace to hit 18 by 30 is a really nice pace to have. Ooh, hang on, hang on. Yeah, I'll try and go this way since he's going around, make sure he doesn't have anywhere to go. And we get Icy on him. Oh, he's just dipping early. I don't think he gets to do this at all. There we go. That's a little double uppercut that we got to be looking for. So much better like that. Yeah, that poor guy. This has been a brutal Richter lane for him. I do feel bad. Especially because I respect playing... I don't know if it's exactly off meta, but in like the newbier games that I'm still in, nobody's really playing tanky solos. I think that's more of a like, once you play longer thing to be playing, like Steel Solo, Richter Solo, even the Severog. Oh my god, the thing's got so little distance when we don't have a charge. I do kind of want to clap him, I feel like we just don't get to. Try and make sure we actually get this right inhibitor. Oh, we do. I would have dashed on him there if we had the cooldown just a little bit sooner. That's too bad. <laughs> just run in the middle of their team. All right, they're not. Yeah, they're not liking this. They're not liking this. That's fair. All right, what if we do a little that, though? Could I have actually double dashed? I thought they'd chase harder. I actually could have double dashed. I wasted my flash so hard. Nice. Tactical distraction. We get left inhibitor off that. <laughs> I just simply looked too juicy right there to not try and murder. And in all fairness, if that guy got better follow-up, they probably do just murder me. Back we go. Yeah, by the way, the ult cooldown, absolutely ridiculous right now. It is down to 18 seconds. I want to say the base cooldown is 60 at rank 1, and then gets to 30 at rank 3. And then, with the actual ability haste we have, it's all the way down to 18. So, it doesn't mean a whole lot, it just means we get a repeat in ability, but that is pretty strong. Because that kind of turns the ult into just an ability, you know? Let's see, can I at least clean this man up? There we go. I want to make sure he's actually dying. I think we're killing in a sec. Yeah, I was really honestly just trying to get the inhib there. I didn't expect him to go on me. Like, I figured I would not greed kills and we just get every single inhib. Make life a lot easier and the game, you know? Oh my god, I actually got trapped. Oh, and I almost killed him anyways. If I was cleaner with the, uh, the ult there, we probably could have. Oh, try it, buddy! There we go. That's the clean ult. I don't know if we're playing this character ever again. <laughs> I'll probably play him jungle just, like, because I can. I actually... He just seems like... I feel like I genuinely need, like, five games to basically master him. Like, I've gotten two in. I think I probably need five more, and I'll just feel like I know exactly what to do on him. And And that's not what I'm looking for, right? That's not the most exciting thing. So, <laughs> while I do have fun beating people up, I think I think we might stick to other people. 26k damage that game, man. And I could have done so much more, too. Like, I feel like it easily could have been 35k if I really tried to bully more. Instead of more so just kind of looking for objectives and just kind of ganking when it actually made sense. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you all enjoyed the video. And I will see you all in the next one. I've been seeking for the glory, say, say, say my name And I've been trying to write my own story in the search for fame I'm sitting here in this empty room
walls keep tumbling down. 